Well, my background is in sailing. I grew up, um, my parents had a sailing boat. It's all I ever wanted to do was sail and go to sea. When I, when I had my accident, sailing wasn't part of my life. Sailing was my life and it was taken away from me. And I made a conscious decision for six, seven years after that not to go near sailing again because I didn't feel that someone with my disability, um, my level of disability, it would be possible. And uh, someone seven years after my accident introduced me to a dinghy, a sailing dinghy called a Challenger Trimaran and I sat in this little boat and I pulled that main sheet in and the tiller and it accelerated across the water and I felt that wind, that spray, the, just that elation of, of being back on the water again. And it was at that moment that I realised this is what I wanted to spend the rest of my life doing. Um, after I did, a couple of, I did a couple of quite significant sailing challenges, I sailed around Great Britain and I sailed across the Atlantic. Um, and what I learned from those uh, adventures was that I was inspiring people. People were following what I was doing and people were asking me how they could get involved and get on the water. And it was when I finished sailing across the Atlantic, I came up with this idea, why don't I create uh, a boat that can take other disabled people, my friends and family, and their friends out on the water because clearly there was something stopping them and it was the right boat. It, the whole Wet Wheels thing started with me and this boat, the original boat, Wet Wheels Solent. Um, and I was not sure how it was gonna work. I, I, there's me, you know, I'd invested a huge amount of money and time on this magnificent vessel and I wasn't sure how it was going to work. Well quite quickly, after year one when we took nearly a thousand people on the water, that I started to think I've got something quite magic here. That these boats are now collectively going to be taking nearly 5,000 people a year on the water um, and I don't want it to stop there. I want, I want there to be another five at least boats around the country in the next five years. Every single day is a moving day. You know, every single day we, I could tell you stories about people that have come on the boat and for them it's a once in a lifetime experience and for us it's, we're very proud to be able to run this business and run it successfully and develop it and, uh, and hopefully we'll go from strength to strength. I made the decision when I set up Wet Wheels that we were not going to be a charity. We weren't going to be governed by volunteers. This was a business. So when I heard of the Stelios Awards uh, and I looked at the criteria, I thought, actually, maybe we, I fit the bill. You know, I've got this, this business that's su successful and we've got ambitions to go places. So um, I put my name down and filled in the form and you can imagine I was overwhelmed to know that I've been shortlisted. I've got huge respect for Stelios. He's a, you know, a, a, a fantastic entrepreneur. And, uh, and just to be nominated, shortlisted by him is, uh, is a tremendous accolade for our business.